What's up guys, it's Rob and today we are in Gordé and we're doing a little road trip to several uh, little villages here in France in the Provence. It's very beautiful here. We have 30 degrees, the sun is shining, I'm sweating like hell and it's absolutely not... and I really want to jump into a pool right now but there is none anywhere here. So, we're exploring these little cities, we are in Gordé, we are in Roussillon, we are in Abt, I guess that's the right pronunciation of it. And we check out these cities and the little surroundings, there is a lot to see and the views here are, are amazing. So, I hope you enjoy the video and we start exploring now. the Abbey Notre Dame de Senang and this is the place I'm pretty dark this is the place where the lavender fields are and at the moment they are already harvested so um, it's not the purple famous lavender fields we know from the pictures but uh, I guess the Abbey is still a very interesting place and we check it out now so let's go Drone flight prohibited. All right. We call the police. Oh, oh my god. So you can enter the abbey and visit it and the entry is 7 euro 50 uh, per adult. Uh, I choose to not to go inside because we want to go further to another place called Rousselion and we have not much time uh, left um, so the best time I think the best time to come here to experience the lavender fields is uh, between June and August this place was built in 1148 and you can visit it in an hour if you go inside check it out uh, and have time but we're going now to Rousselion to uh, explore more of the cities here in this area. place here is called Ocre Footpath and you find it in Roussillon. The city of Roussillon is very close by to Gordé. You can easily do this in one trip. So if you visited Gordé, you go to Roussillon, it takes around 30 minutes and then you are at the Ocre Footpath and it's very interesting to see. It reminds me a lot of Colorado. The entry costs around 250 and you have a huge area to walk around. This place looks a lot like a scenery from the Mars or something. The red sand is crazy uh, and the only thing that reminds me that I'm on earth are the trees everywhere and the stairs. I'm pretty exhausted. They are everywhere <laughs> and if you're not really fit maybe you should do the short route. We decided to go the long route by mistake uh, and now we <laughs> ended up running through the forest here uh, but it's very interesting and lovely to see but I'm sweating like hell. So we are super exhausted and I hope that this track will end soon that I get something to eat because I'm really starving and I want to eat something. place which is called the Alhambra uh, which is dedicated to the city in Spain and we have the choice between French cuisine and uh, Moroccan 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 Moroccan, Moroccan <laughs> and we have the choice between French cuisine and Moroccan cuisine one more thing the waitress is I don't know if she's the owner of the restaurant but she's very lovely and it's a very welcoming place here so I have a tagine with chicken and potatoes inside and flavored with citrons and uh, 
olives and it's very nice it's so delicious you have no idea all right guys we are back in our airbnb and this day was so exhausting but very worth it these small villages here in the south of france are <laughs> They are very beautiful and very stunning. Hope you enjoyed this video. Um, the last city up isn't that worth to visit. So you can easily skip on that and concentrate on the two cities of Gordet and Roussillon. And then you maybe go further to Aix-en-Provence where we go next uh, and tomorrow. Uh, we go to uh, Aix-en-Provence and this is our last stop. The highlight for me was the scenery of the city of Gordé, how it's built into the mountain or on the mountain and with the view over the complete south of France. It's crazy. Now we are very tired, super exhausted. I thought like I ran a marathon today. Uh, and yeah, that's it for today. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. If so, please leave me a like and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Would be awesome if you do. So uh, until then I have to say until then I have to say thanks and goodbye. See you next week.